the traveling artism is back at Gilenor, but this time it's with a slight twist. First off, on how to get here, you want to make your way to the Draenor Lodestone, and then run east to where I am at. Afterwards, you will see three additional NPCs. Zode, which I'm by. Laru. And then Lurik. Those are for the charity ones, but first we'll speak to Cal. And this one, it, it's more of like the Rise Above the Disorder charity, the CPSL Mind charity, and then the Princesses, the Prince, Princess Trust, Prince Trust. Actually, I don't know if that's a boy or a girl, the Prince says trust okay that's a weird way for it to be saying but anyway you can right click cow and open the interface and this is where you turn in your traveling artism points that you have been getting every i don't know five ten minutes of skilling or killing now for the other npcs you want to right click information on them go through the space bar And then you can speak to them. Every two days, they'll give you a question. So just hit option one or option two, actually. And then he's telling you that every two days, you'll be able to ask him some questions. So, okay. So, two. Okay, we'll just talk to Zod first. For instance, when she asks you a question for a reward, she will say that warning because some questions can tear severe difficulties like depression and suicide. And then they'll give you links, but they won't really give you links. You just have to manually type that in if you want. And then hit continue or don't ask again. And then this one, they'll say what percent of those with a mental age condition develop for age 24. This one is 75. Yep, but it's fine. If you don't get it right, you can re talk to her again and just pick one of the three until you eventually get it right if you don't know the answer. And then she'll give you a small prismidian lamp. This does actually work for Iron Man to answer those questions. And then she'll give you another question small XP lamp in two days. And then speak to Lulu. And it'll be the same thing, but this time a different website they give. And here it says the percent of UK teachers that worry about their kids when they leave school for work. That will be 70%. And that's because honestly, school does not prepare you for the real world whatsoever. And then let's talk to Cal. And then continue. And this one is what does the rise above the disorder do? That will be provide mental health, uh, live stream games that involve mental health issues. Option four. Oh, okay. You'll ask the question again. To continue, what do they do? I guess makes a game about mental health. Nope. Okay. Continue. What do they do? I guess option one. Free help to everybody. Okay, there we go. And then, boom. Now, in two days, you can come back for three more small XP lamps. And just use it on whatever you want. There is also a bank chest here. Which it might be good for picking the wheat from the field north. I mean, that's about it, honestly, because the nearby trees, as you can tell, they've been pretty much chopped except these three normal trees and then this willow tree right here. So the bank has very limited uses, if any, early. And with that, 
That will be all about the charity events that are going about with the mental awareness. Thank you all so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.